Hey guys, welcome back to Data with Dominic. And in today's video, we're going to be looking at how you can upload a CSV file directly from your system onto Microsoft Fabric. So let's dive right into the demo. In the previous video, uh, which I linked to in the top right hand corner of the screen, we looked at how you could um, uh, create a lake house in your Fabric workspace. And in this video, we're going to be looking at how to upload a CSV into that works into that lake house. So what you need to do is first um, come to your workspaces and head to whichever workspace you created the lake house in. So I've created this lake house one in the last video, and we're gonna select the lake house one artifact, which is off type lake house. So when you create a lake house, by default you get a data set and an SQL endpoint. We'll be looking at what those are later on, but for now we're gonna choose the one of type lake house and to upload files is very simple all you have to do is you just need to come over to this file section because it's a lake house you have tables and files for structured and unstructured so for files you just click on this three dots and upload files or folder once you click on that search bar you'll get a uh, get the browse option and you can then choose to upload files you have the option to overwrite if you want but you can just upload right away and the second you upload you'll notice that when you click on this files tab you do have your csv which you've uploaded come in there and you can click on your csv to preview it and then you can see that all your data has come in there successfully so this is how you upload uh, a CSV from your system directly into the micro Microsoft Fabric lake house in your workspace. Uh, that's it for this video. Uh, don't forget to like, subscribe, share, comment and hit the bell icon and stay subscribed for many more videos on Microsoft Fabric.